that Pan Am. She offered help. Yeah, let's get Pan Am back. Up, Those guys are trailer tuggers. An assault on Arasaka is just not another convoy to Jack. You already tried this with amateurs. Both know how that ended. And you tried it with pros. Didn't end any fucking better. You don't want those people involved. Their lives on the line, possibly on your conscience. Our one hope is sitting at the afterlife right now, and her name is Rogue. Hanako's offer's on the table. I don't know what to do. I hate those moments in games. I'm, I'm so indecisive. Oh, I'll cut the crap. <laughs> ah! She actually has power. Could be our ticket. Yeah, one-way ticket to the city morgue. That Sokka cunt scrambled your circuits. Rogue and I will handle this, just like we used to. Johnny acting like he didn't fail and get captured by Arasaka when he did the same. Yes, this is the thing, he got turned into an aggro- I know! I know! He's literally like, saying like, we do this like 50 years ago, which is probably the worst outcome. And then at the same time, I find his idea- I find his idea so much cooler <laughs> than just going with like- the other one because I also want to go rogue get rogue into it again. It's like uh, ah! There's a thing I want to talk about here after finish, okay. This is Michael, don't you not yours. You really think rogues give you a shot? But this is Michael. Gotta stop you, dickhead. What's your scheme? This is my body, I make the calls. Not this time. Uh, Johnny. Jesus, look at you. Can't even Great, you checking out again? <laughs> um. What? Am I? Am I dead? No, no, no. Easy there. Don't oh, move just girl. yet. Check, please. That's a big. You're in pain, I know. Delirious when you arrived, so I had to dose you with beta haloperidol. Oh, what's this? But even? light oversensitivity is a good sign. Means your optic nerves aren't damaged. My head. Ah. Almost done stabilizing the biochip. Oh, feels like someone's using your head as a knife block. How? How'd I get here? Drags yourself here, beat to hell and back. Gave Misty a hell of a fright. Then you shoved my patient at the time off the table and demanded you be treated immediately. Talman was your guardian angel. Huh? I, uh, wasn't completely myself. Yeah, I know. And that's a bit worrying. To me straight, Vic. You've come to a critical juncture. Try sitting up carefully. I'll try. I think I'm getting some feeling back. Ah, Just slowly. Ah, another victory for the history books. You're fucked, B. You're a mad fuck. That's my professional opinion. Yeah. Well. Yeah. Looks like I can sit up all right, but I can tell you don't have good news. How much longer is this going to go on? You tell me. Looking at you, not long at all. Next attack, you won't be able to crawl back here. You'll flatline in some back alley. This is your last chance to take matters into your own hands. Understand? Yeah, I know. Thoughts on where to start? Jesus, again. Do I have to spell it out? It's in your hands, not mine, and not those of that... 
thing in your head. He has very pretty nails. Now, see that setup over there? Yeah, what about it? You'll find a last dose of pseudo endo in there. A gift from Misty. Want to give in to the voices in your head? Go ahead. Take a puff. Go silent. Get out. Or find another way. And think <sighs> terms. I don't want to, like... Get a little present for me over there, too. Blockers. Managed to walk those few yards to the table. It's like Matrix was pulled in your you tank right you on a blue. You heard him. We no. got one last chance. Mm -hmm. I'm taking the wheel. Uh -uh. Endo Trizine, Rogue Sokka Tower. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Only way this is gonna work. Mm -mm. Give I'm not giving fucking him the rest, wheel. Johnny. It's, it's my, my decision, and I gotta think about it. Need to stretch your noodle? noodle? Fine. Just not, Just not in this, in this basement. basement. V, Christ, you're talking out loud. Oh, out loud? What? Just go fix this thing. Sure. Uh, think I can do it. Oh no! Oh, I forgot. Whatever you decide. Oh. Uh, Let's make sure to get out of here. I forgot here which first. one was which one. I'm never listening perfectly to it. Ay, 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 ay. Hi, Missy. Hey, V, I heard. Well, your thoughts? Shouldn't have had to. Sorry about that. No need to be. I know what's going on. And I know it won't be easy for either of you. If you don't want to decide here, I know a much better place. Sure. Got a feeling Vic's had enough of me as is. Don't be mad at him. No, I'm not. His chakras are all blocked up today. Plus, he's had too much coffee. Oh, well. Let me guess. It's only that. My aura is sputtering. Mm hmm. Afraid so. Sure. Lead the way. Why is this spot special? I took Jackie there once. It's not far. Jackie? What's he got to do with any of this? You'll see. Come on. We'll see what this is about. Top uh, floor. He had the same glum face. Who, Jack? This is it, Chica. I'm done for. Doesn't sound like the Jackie I knew. That was a long time ago. His mom had just found out he'd signed up with the Valentinos. Trust me. Senora Wells on one shoulder, your gang Chumba's on the other. No choice can ever seem right. Mm -hmm. hmm. Life wasn't easy for my Jackie, but... He found the courage to bet on himself. After. I brought him here. She's thinking like I have like I have an idea what I'm supposed to do now. I mean, ah, that's more like it. Air. See that? I come here when I need to get away. Be alone with my thoughts. She's on to something. Ought to sit, mull through some shit yourself. Misty, you were right. Choice spot. So what... What did Jackie decide up here? Oh, you know. Gonna be a legend in this city. It looks pretty cool. And I'm gonna leave you alone now. Take your time. Thanks, girl. Fucking scared me, know that? Thought you were on your way out. No, I'm still here. For now. You know, should call anyone you want to say goodbye to. Worst case scenario. That what you expect? No. But whatever you decide, risk's gonna be high. 
if things don't go our way. Just fucking do it. Anyone you gotta talk to, now's the time. Pills can wait. <gasps> There is this one stubborn badge. Oh, right about baby boy. Hey, V. Hey, I uh, wake you. Nah, wasn't asleep. Shipping containers again. Uh, worse. What could be worse than that? Uh, pursuing somebody else's botched case. Fuck up. Well, don't know. Hard to explain. Question is, what are you doing up? Might have had a bad dream too. No, Carrie, no. Kind of like yours. My boy. The only guy who wants also, me. <laughs> also lived a double life. Mm. As an overweight detective, his mortal backbone made of hot dog buns. Tried that rocker boy with the bloated ego. Sounds nasty. Yep. Trade places with me? Listen, seeing as you're not asleep either, what do you say to little nightcap? Can't. Not today. Probably not anytime soon. Everything all right? Yeah, just got something on my mind. You know, might not have been the best cop in Night City, but I can tell when someone's... Talking out their ass? Not speaking the whole truth. Find yourself in some trouble. Fierce variety. Might have been the trouble that found me. <clears throat> well, that might just be what I like most about you. Hey, I gotta go. Wait, wait. Whatever it is, you can count on me, okay? I know. Thanks, River. Hang in there. Where's carriage to help your soul? I was talking at HQ with hugs and kisses. Okay. Well, I'm a, I'm a woman, so That's he doesn't want call. me. Wish I'd have had the chance to. Come a long way to get here, haven't we? That is true. Just think. It all started in a fucking landfill. Mm -hmm. Then you tried to kill me. See exactly what I mean. Trying to save your sorry hide now. You can let me do that. Or you can try Pan Am and her tarmac rats. Oh, but then their lives will weigh heavy on your soul. Or you take Arasaka's deal, but then you'll have your own soul on your conscience. Gonna ask Pan Am. I wanna do Pan Am. I definitely wanna do Pan Am. Gonna try to ask Pan Am for help. You have to right on your sure. face. There's such a soul. No going back on this, you know. God, also just I can just kill myself here and be like done. What the fuck? Never just I was like that busy. Yeah, Pan definitely. We're a lot alike. Trust her more than any of your iron for hire chumbas. Have it your way. Could be my last ride, this. If it don't work out, uh... Just wanna be there for it. Where? Yeah, I should have that choice. I think it's an easy way to chicken out otherwise. See you inside, Mikoshi. Johnny? Okay, just me now. I call it Hanako. Ah. Oh, Hanako, not Hanako. P? Hello! Hey, Do you know what time it is? I know. 3 a.m. Need your help. And you owe me a favor. What's so damn urgent? I couldn't wait until morning. Shinako. Need a way into our socket tower. Now. Sorry, what? I'm serious. Whole thing with Johnny? I don't do something soon. I'm done. Gone. Slow down. First, why Arasaka Tower? The tech. Underneath that tower, they got an access point to... Well... 
Odd as it sounds, a prison of souls. A prison of souls? No. This might not fly over the hollow. Makoshi, that's its name. Only place Johnny and I can disentangle for good. It's my last chance. So, again, just to be clear, you've called me at High Moon to ask me to help you break into Arasaka Tower, or you'll die. Yeah? About the gist of it, yeah. Okay. What? Okay. Where are you? Vic's clinic. The Ripper? Right, I know where it is. Can you hold off on dying for a bit? Give it a shot, sure. Good. Don't go anywhere. I'm coming to get you. Alright. That worked surprisingly well so far. Best friend vibes? Yeah, absolutely. I love Panem. She's a really cool person. <coughs> she is a very cool one. Is that you, V? Or... Yeah, it's me. So, what now? Waiting for my driver. Come inside. We'll wait together. Panem was Garrus in this for me. Yeah, she's kind of like the same vibe as Garrus. You have to wait. Mind if I give you a reading? Sure, why not? Let's see. Some believe uncertainty is an evil that should be dispelled through divination. Others claim it's change that is evil. But that isn't true either. Every minute of every day, we each become someone new. We shouldn't fear change itself, but only who we might change into. Knowing one's path is most important. I devised this layout especially for you and Johnny. Your future is his future, and vice versa. Okay, I'm ready. We'll start with you, V. The Fool. <laughs> what yep. a surprise. Fitting. Let's dig deeper to find its meaning here. The Fool symbolizes the start of a journey, the announcement of something new. It's the inner child, curious of the world, but also naive and reckless. <laughs> Sounds a lot like the V I first met. The Magician. A person of great talent and charisma. A leader. Sounds like Johnny. The card is reversed. That can mean a tendency toward addiction, mental instability. Okay. Definitely, Definitely Johnny. Johnny. He is one great disturbance. The final cards are about your futures. The lovers. <sighs> Something that doesn't give me the chills. Finally. Balance, friendship, love. Though it can also mean difficult choices ahead. Ain't that the truth? Okay. And Johnny's? I'm so moon. nervous about what's going to happen. Well, doesn't like, sound too bad, right? This makes me actually so impatient because I'm very know, nervous v. and I just want to experience the story. The and moon say, is mystery. Oh. Hmm. I think that's for you. I think you're right. Yep. No mistake in that ride ever. Hi. Man, it's good to see your face. Larry, I thought Jesus, the same. You do look terrible. So. And I feel worse. I miss Then we had best Pan not waste on. any time. We have a long road ahead of us. Come on. Everybody's waiting at camp. Nice. Look out for yourself, V. I will, Misty. I was too fast out of the door. Sorry, girl. Thank thanks. <coughs> Welcome back to the living. You feeling okay? What happened? You passed out on the way. 
We tried shaking you awake, to no avail. Sure does seem like your condition might be getting worse, V. You're gonna say me. Pan Am asked me to keep an eagle eye on you. Where'd she go? She's off debating Saul. You need help, that's clear. They sat right down to figure out how we might do that. Come on, I'll take you to see him. So, V, I heard talk that there's a war coming. Fred, I don't got a choice, Mitch. Looks like we don't have one Can't either. Say I missed you. The whole clan knows we set out tomorrow. They know why, what our aim is. Look around, V. War tested <laughs> veterans are a fistful at most. The rest mostly raid rinky dick convoys and salvage scrap. So for now, they only know as much as they need to know. The aim is to help you out. Not now. We're sending this clan to its grave. Fuck, you think I don't know that? And yet you seem to think you can change something by chewing me out like you usually do. V, finally. How's your health? Been better. So, what have you guys patched together? We still have details to iron out, but we know the who, where, and how. Have a look for yourself. A few strategies we sussed out, but only one brands us a decent shot at penetrating Arasaka Tower. We'll dig a tunnel. You, you dig a tunnel? Sure, these plans are up to date. Completely reliable. Positively. We went to our Snake Nation sources. They've been turning stones over in that area. I'm not one to lie. This tunnel gambit is risky. But if it works, that's our way into Mikoshi. So you want a tunnel into Arasaka Tower? I know how it sounds. It sounds crazy. We'd be plumb fools not to take advantage. I see Night Corps building a new maglev line in the area. Granted, it's guarded by Militech, but they're nothing we can't handle. Once we're in that tunnel, it's just half a mile to the substratum levels of Arasaka Tower. They're using one of Night Corps' cirques. We'd only need a few minutes to dig that distance. Not bad, wouldn't you say? Once we're in, we'll have to improvise. Guards, security measures, the fastest way into Mikoshi. We'll take things as they come and hope for the best. V, any thoughts? Sounds absolutely great. What's a cirque? A subterranean extraction and removal combine. It's automated tunnel boring. If we can grab one, We'll dig through to Arasaka Tower, then go on to Mikoshi. Construction mm, site. Mm, absolutely. What do we got for security? Old place spiked? Militech out in full force? It's your average hard hat area. Nothing too scary. But we can't just walk past them. We expect to see the usual. Drone patrols, on-site operators, restricted access. Uh-huh. Mm. Plan. Entire op. It's about heading into enemy territory. You'll make enemies of Arasaka and others. So it appears. I'm exposing you, all of you, to danger. Want out, want to cut your losses? I'd understand. No hard feelings. You came to us for help. We decided we'd provide it. Our minds are made up. No more discussion needed. It's settled. We had best get to work. I'll talk to our brothers and sisters. Get a drone buzzing over that site. And I'll check with Mitch. I think I know how to even the odds against Militech. Come find us later. Oh, it's the Basilic coming into Just action. Just no making decisions without me. Ooh. Is there anything else you need? Hey, you and Pan Am. Something I need to know about. It's funny you should ask. I thought we'd smoothed over the rough edges between us. Then you showed up. Oh, so I'm the one? Any day now. Doubt that's entirely true. I don't have any hard feelings towards you, V. The opposite, in fact. See, V, you're like the outsider who happens upon a family and witnesses nothing but endless quarrels. Then all of a sudden, the outsider's presence is noticed, and the family members shake hands, join hands, become stronger than they were before. Understand? Yeah. At least I think so. Good. So now you can tell me what else you'll need. Never got us uh, right to the right, yeah. Need a decent neck connection. Someone I know can help us get into Mikoshi. Who might that be? Alt. She's. It's. an AI from out past the Black Wall. Are you fully present up there? Why in hell would an AI help us break into Mikoshi? Because I'll ask it to. Nicely. Fuck, maybe. 
trust me? Pretty please? You know what? Fine. We're up to our balls and dung anyway. Might as well go deeper. Find Dakota. She'll get you geared up. No questions asked. Thanks, Saul. Thank me once we get out of Mikoshi alive and in one piece. Wait, where's Dakota? Dakota? Ah! Are you... Oh, who are you? I'm looking for Dakota. Where the fuck is Dakota? I wasn't listening when she he said like, "Are you Dakota?" <gasps> I remember her. Hey, Saul sent me. Chamai, brother of the backers. What is it you need? Need a strong rig for a little jaunt on the net. Okay, get in. Not at all curious what I'm going in for. You don't ask me, I don't ask you. That is the path to a lasting relationship, brother. Everything is ready. You can go in. I love those eyes. Yeah. I should have tough. been romanceable. Yeah. A bit. I was still talking to Ola. I would have loved to. Carol, here to help Dakota? Uh, Evidently, I'm here to help you today. You good to go? Okay, so Can't say how long this is gonna take. Whatever happens, stay cool, all right? Even if you look like you're about to flatline? Especially then, probably. All right, time to move. Follow the vectors, bro. Hello, Alt. You come alone. This place changes every time. Feels like I'm deeper. Can't tell if that's a good or bad thing. Your perception of cyberspace, that is what changes. You adapt to it, the raw flow of data. It follows that your world gradually fades. You witness your mind's defense system slowly give in. Saying, the more I'm here, the more I lose touch with the outside, with reality. You lose nothing. Cyberspace is where we awake from what we know as dreams. Johnny's currently indisposed. Currently. He is buried deeper. You treat him like an unwanted passenger, a backseat dreamer of a world not his own. Seemed to me you didn't care a lick about Johnny. That he ceased to exist for you, even. If he did not exist, you and I would have nothing to discuss. Okay, oh, she's a poet too, okay, yeah, apparently. V. Let me get this straight. I mean to say, you only agreed to help me because of Johnny. And since he's not here this one time, you're thinking of backing out. I do not aim to back out. I have my own intentions for Mikoshi. Because mm -hmm. for a second you were displeased, and I seemed a side note to all this. To observe the two of you interacting. Informative. Need your help, Alt. Don't got a lot of time left. You truly believe time to be your greatest concern. You exist or you do not exist. Two states of being separated by death. Thank you so much for telling me that. Matter of perspective. Think what you will, but seems to me I rose from the dead. 
Only question is, what now? You believe you cheated death. It is death that has cheated you. You are in between. Thanks! You will begin to understand, but only in Mikoshi. Why don't you swoop down on your chariot and enlighten me? Surely an all-powerful AI can handle that. Your logic is flawed. You seek simple answers where there simply are none. Uh. This is the very illusion upon which your world is based. At this moment, you would accept any answer if it made you feel better. Hmm. Guess that'd be human of me. Quiet. Such classifications no longer apply in Mikoshi. Your perception will shatter into billions of strings of unfiltered data. Awesome, that sounds lovely. Fancy way of saying you're too stupid to understand me. Yeah. A boundary to cross. <laughs> In all likelihood, the sole moment of I'm your so life true. when you feel the true weight of your existence. A burden for which you cannot prepare. And Johnny? What happens to him? I lack the data required to answer this question. There anything we can know for certain? Yes. That Mikoshi will be no more. Constructs imprisoned there. Gonna set them free? They will be integrated with me. That sounds strong. Constructs will be integrated? Mean you're gonna absorb them? Assimilate. No wonder you jumped at this chance. You want to destroy Mikoshi. Swallow all the psyches in there. Mikoshi is a prison. Through me, they gain the chance to become part of something greater. Not sure Johnny would like the sound of that. And yet he is absent, because you feel you must make the decision. It is the same situation in form. <laughs> Hardly. Damn it, you can't ask the point there. Constructs, ask them what they think. There would be no point in this. Wasting time talking. Let's just do this. There. I sent a program to your Netrunner shard. Once inside Mikoshi, use it. It opens a secure connection. What's on the shard? A vectored virus? A back door. It will open a passage for me. This is how you will get me into Mikoshi. Only then will I be able to help Daddy you. Program. Hope you haven't cooked up any surprises, <laughs> old. Use the key once you have reached Mikoshi. What am I supposed to do with the shard? You must slot it into an access point. I will take care of the rest. This meeting will not be our last, should you succeed. Yay! We got him back. Carol, the shard! Relax, child. You barely jacked in when your temperature went skyward to almost 105. The tech started acting as if infected. No. Stranger. Spookier. What happened here? You melted half my tech. That's what happened. Neural Oops. activity spiked sharply. Your frontal lobe was seconds away from flowing out your ears, babe. I could just as well have popped a bullet in your head. Mm. Are you sure you're all right? Sorry about the damage. Peachy. Good. Real good. The shard. Wrote some soft I need to one of the shards. Please. We're surrounded by ice. Even if something punched through, my controllers would have... Holy... Get it away from me. Thanks, Dakota. Don't thank me. She's like, oh! Nope, that wasn't good at all. Mm -mm. All right, let's go to Mitch then. Let's get the party started very soon, I guess, right? Yes. Fellas? We heard we're gearing up for a minor war. More like a suicide mission. Finish it up here, all right? Hey, right now? Okay, Saul needs me. Come find us after. Will do. Lo and behold, isn't this... In theory, we fitted an afterburner and a multi-RPG launcher up top. We also scooped out about 60% of total mass. Beautiful, isn't she? 
<laughs> You'll take the wheel with Pan Am riding shotgun. And all of a sudden, she just has like a cone of fries in the sand. Let's go. Standard nitro or military grade? <laughs> Standard couldn't move this baby an inch. So, that was stupid. nitrous oxide injection into military hardware? Heard Raffins do the same thing with their armored pickups for going after convoys. Except it isn't exactly stable. You'd think you plain couldn't jazz up a panzer that way, huh? When we unleash this beast tomorrow, you'll see. Since tomorrow's a big day already, how about we take it for a spin now? Want to get a feel for her over the terrain. Sure thing. Maybe after sundown, though. We still have a few loose screws to tighten. That's putting it mildly. Will you quit being such a sourpuss? We'll have her ready in time. Firepower up top. What is it? A rapid-fire 70-millimeter multiple rocket launcher coupled with an onboard MMI you can sync to via personal link. Where'd you get all this stuff? Teddy salvaged it from a scrapyard. The launcher itself was fine. The problem was no ammunition. As luck would have it, Dakota procured some. Don't ask me how. You better don't want to know how to fix I get. Talk later things. then, I guess. I mean, I don't know. Like, we're done. And you have no other options. So, yeah, Mitch, sorry, but. Let's get back to the matter at hand, shall we? Bye. Sounds good. Sounds lovely. <laughs> so. You wanted a word? Hop up here. What's with the gathering? Something off? It's nothing about the raid. Hop on and you'll find out. Keep We're mind. going somewhere? All right, V. It's a simple matter. We, all of us standing here, owe you. And it's a great debt. Speak for yourself, Saul. So. But in spite of that, you're still an outsider. Bob doesn't like me. A mercenary from Night City. What might as well be another world. Hey, ask Pan Am. She knows. So it's about time we fix that. Downright injustice it is. Can you like it shut up? Fix you're it. gonna be an Aldo Caldo. Ooh. Which means this family will go to hell and back for you. Ooh. Ready, kid? Come on, V. Say your piece. I'm sorry. Are you all sure about this? Does this look like one big jest? I know what this means. At this point, I kiss everyone. I used to wear clan like, colors to too. Like, obviously, it's no one wants to be Cal, though, I, I don't know if you Just should. Just answer the question. Are you ready? Yes. You're the worst. You're one of us now, B. You're an Aldo Caldo, dammit. Right there, Thanks for everything, V, and don't worry. We'll get you into that Makoshi. <gasps> Isn't that the welcome way of it? Welcome to the family. Get a, good a warm welcome for our newest Aldo Caldo. He Welcome to the clan. What's the it they say? Easy to gain a cobra's trust than an Aldecaldos. Well spoken. So I know how much this means to you, to me. Thank you. I'm not, not let you cry. down. Don't worry, it's but a formality. You've been a de facto member of this family for a while now. You saved my rumpus, and as Bobby tells it, Mitch's too. I won't even mention Pan Am. Go to hell. Saul's right, though. I mean, let's face it, V. My life was in a million pieces. You broke it into a million more. But sometimes it's only then that you can piece it together again. All right, fam, listen up. Today we celebrate, Avocado. but tomorrow we're shaping up to be a hell of a day. Do whatever needs doing. Then get some rest. A raid is a raid. But this is still your night. So bask a bit in the found glory. Could have given me a heads up about this. And ruined all the fun? Are you kidding? Are you all right? Yeah. yeah. It's nothing. Don't worry about it. And how's the jacket? Not too tight? Are you all right? I miss this, you know? The camaraderie. I know. I saw it in your heart the first time we met. Probably because I was missing it too then. Night City, you're alone. Even in a crowd. But here, feels like I'm part of something important. So you are where you need to be. Hey. Thanks, Pan Am. If you want to talk, I'll be up there. All of Sunday's shiny loot? I need some ammunition. Three or four packs worth. Got any left? I might you have. Uh... You have to look around. 
mad at me. So maybe I'll take two more 45s. I've found a dead magpie under the hood of my car. It had been a cold night. The magpie, looking for warmth, had found the engine. And couldn't get out next morning. Got cooked alive. I still remember the smell. Charred feathers, misery, death. The moment I met you, that vision appeared before my eyes. Today, I understand why. Oh, uh, okay. Sorry I even brought it up. But your future is not etched in stone, B. Remember that. Mm -hmm. What's this? Yard sale of some sort? Essentially. Take what you want. And the occasion would be... The end times. Worthy gesture. Dramatic, even. Actually, pragmatic. I'm giving away my stock to you so you survive tomorrow's mad hell and come back to me. Yeah. I mean, I take everything. I, you give loot, I will eventually take loot. I had it just a second ago, I swear. To whom else can I tell her this might be the end? Outside of your head. Is it like maybe a little bit mean of me to drag all the avocados in? And I, yes, I'm just gonna call them avocados. Oh, hi, hey, Bruce. Hey, how you been, Bruce? Sprouted your first shy roots yet? Hey, V. Got a worn out truth for you. Camps aren't all alike. Feel at home here. I mean, like, it's possible I'll make this my home. Dakota says I got valuable knowledge, like uh, safe passages south, areas to avoid. I don't know, but feels good. I'm glad to hear it. It's a good place for you, this. Yeah, hope it will be. Thanks again. You're welcome. Just wait till I'm I never have a water. Oh, that nee. water of yours won't scare anybody. Not even if you spike the rim. Thanks. No! I need a water, guys. For fuck's sake. Yeah. No. I look like sheet. Sheet ton of bull. Like the jacket was really, really cool. But holy shit, I can't. Sorry, guys, but. I mean, this kind of also looks. It's actually the same module of jacket, just a little bit different. So, should be no, alright. I, I want to look hard when I die anyway, right? So, <laughs> you give me this. Can I talk to Saul? You got other business? I too have got things to do, you know. Talk to Mitchell's also. I'm so confused. Uh, to who I'm supposed to talk. Like, talk to the Normans. Everything's optional. And then, yeah, I don't know. We're gonna talk to Mitch. Hey! Hey! I'll go, thanks. What just happened? Still can't quite wrap my head around it. Hardly anyone ever does. The day you get your jacket is a day you never forget. So, time for a ride? Sure she's ready? You know me. I'd gladly spend another two days on her, but this'll have to do. Hop in. Let's see what she's made of. Basilisk, let's go. Got green across the board. Good sign. Where are we headed? Bobby said there's a scrapyard east of camp. Perfect spot for a little target. Are we heading back? Punch it, V. Oh, there. Am I?
the car. Seems so. She is the basilisk is so low. Living in those houses. I'll have to check before tomorrow if her guts are kind of like something just don't sound right to my ear. Uh -huh. Are we heading back? Yeah, we are heading back. That's correct. If you I just I'll can't take her now. Thank you, bitch. I get picky about parking. Yeah, that, that sounds good, bitch. Just park over me. It's um, always a place world of thanks. Yeah. For oh, just a brief moment. No, just a brief moment. All right. Uh, I have a. Mm. Hello. You nervous about tomorrow? It's not a matter of nerves. <sighs> not anymore. I'm nervous about tomorrow. Don't you want sure. one? Yeah, sure. Uh, why the hell? Remember, also my last one, right? So. Who cares for the carbs and calories and stuff? Back during the war, before we were first deployed, we were trained to keep stress in check. Do you want to know how? How? They gave us chem cocktails. Supplements, boosters, God knows what else. They shot them into our veins. Our biomons went wild, but only for a second before stabilizing, and boy did we stabilize. After a dozen sessions, something clicks in your brain. Neural pathways get rewired. The part of you that generates fear is zapped into oblivion. Thought they banned chem cocktails. During the war, even. Please. Weren't there outbreaks of cyberpsychosis within units? And? Do you think Militech gave a lick about that? No. They just airlifted the afflicted to their clinics in Taiwan. <laughs> Daily flights. And every day we'd get fresh recruits. Still, they pumped us with that shit. But hey, we couldn't argue with the money. Hmm. That's seriously fucked up. It is. What'd you think? That war wasn't effed up? One will head into tomorrow, too? Why? You having second thoughts? I'm not worried about it. And neither should you be. Something else will be keeping me awake. What's that? Nah, no matter. Come on. All in family now, isn't it? True. The truth is I'm concerned about the goings-on between Pan Am and Saul. They seem to think that putting on a brave face for everyone is enough, but folks here aren't slow. There's gossip spreading like wildfire already. That Saul won't pull through, that he's in it for himself. That this family needs a shake-up. And they write. They are, but nobody knows what comes next. Your turn. What do you reckon? Mitch, not gonna be facing a ragtag band of raffin or an exposed convoy. If we want to get out of this op alive, they need to have their shit They're together. They're trying. They might even have started to see eye to eye in their own way. Hell, by now, they both know what's expected of them. What the clan expects of them. That's good, at least, right? At least right? Tommy Saul offered Pan Am a seat at the table. And what gave you the idea Pan Am wants a seat to begin with? I think I get it. Pan Am's about the clan, not power. Question is whether she can reconcile the two. Hey. Don't look at me. It's like this, see? Pan Am's hell-bent on helping you. But Saul sees this whole thing as an opportunity. Possible loot from Makoshi. Mm-hmm. If we pull this off, get our hands on some sweet Arasaka tech that'll set us up down south. Do you follow? It'll 
these folks' fears. Buy Saul some time. Saul's a smooth operator. He knows what he's doing. Let's just hope he hasn't overplayed his hand. Oh, well. We'll see. All right, we've gossiped enough for one day. Probably Always my last just spoken day. stays between us, okay? I'm gonna poke around some in this baby's insides. Right. Happy hunting, Mitch. Oh. I'm done talking with you, right? I w would think I'm done talking with him. Now I can talk with Soul. Yeah. Everything prepped ahead of tomorrow. No worries. Everything's under control. That's Good. No they, they Good night, Saul. How's that news? Wait. Hmm? To run the fuck away. I feel I need to make one thing clear. Flowers? You've done a lot for this clan. Exactly. And for me. More than uh -huh. anyone ever has. But the family comes first. Saul. Let me finish. I also know there's just one thing that could break it up at this point. If Pan Am and me... If we went our separate ways... The Aldecaldos would not survive that split word to occur again. Do you understand what I'm trying to tell you? Wonder if Pan Am feels the same. You all think Pan Am and I are facing off. There's a wall between Isn't us. Isn't there? Quite the contrary, V. Pan Am cares about this clan as much as I do. Granted, we don't see all things the same way, but, oddly enough, the family stands to benefit from that. I've seen it, and soon, you will too. Why are you both then just, like, leading the clan? How about us, Saul? Oh, hello, Michael Jordan. How's it's it going? It's an important day tomorrow. Don't cry. Get some rest. We get through this somehow, maybe, eventually. Over here, V. Take a seat. Well, that's kind of fucked. We have this little that ritual Mr. we Mr. Keanu engage Reeves? In. What's this ritual about? A few cold well, ones ahead of a raid. Uh, the bard was like, nope, I'm gonna intervene kind. this. But this isn't your average brew. It's one of the last bottles from our very first run. We kept a few crates for good luck. What was it someone said then? Shit, can't remember who. Someone said, when we finish them all, the Aldecado's luck will run out. Ah, superstitious bullcrap is your hobby. <laughs> Says the brother whose hand is all shaky when he pops one open. I'll take a swig. Well, well, not bad. To tomorrow. To goddamn safe returns. To Saul and Pan Am. Because if they don't kiss and make up, everything's liable to go tits up. Bob, you're just always the optimist, ain't you? Fee, you must know where they stand. Do I you? have no idea. Like, why am I getting in pulled it into this really bullshit? Like, you. the truth is, we need cash and fast. Amen. This Makoshi is a personal thing to you, but Saul, he sees an opportunity for the clan. If any of the family is still left standing tomorrow. Oh, yeah. Talk to them. They've buried the hatchet. Buried the hatchet? Well, I'm really glad they've come to agree on sending us on a suicide mission. Be cool now, Bobby. There's nothing personal, V. I'm just saying how things are. This is all my fault. I'm exposing the entire family to danger. I'm sorry. You've got nothing to be sorry about. The situation is fixing to be a doozy, sure. But if the Aldecaldos are to rise from the ashes, it'll be thanks to you. And thanks to this raid. Huh. For once, I agree with him. Oh, that's all first. I think Pan Am knows exactly what she's doing. But does she know what she wants? Useful if she wants to take the clan wheel. Cool your heels, friend. No one's taken over anything just yet. We need to focus on tomorrow, brothers. Let's all get back in one piece. Then we talk clan politics. Yeah, you can do whatever. Let me just have another zip of the beer. I can promise you one thing. Aldecaldos will survive. Make sure of it myself. 
Easy on the promises, V. But you're right. This clan has a chance to rise from the ash. I'm of the same mind. If we come back from Mikoshi, if this crazy-ass plan works, it'll be a fresh start for the Aldecaldos, I see. Mm -hmm. This feels like the part where Bobby says, if. Hey, now. I'm no defeatist. Don't call me that. All right. All right, best be going. I want to get, like, more. finally into the last mission. I'm getting a little bit impatient with, like, oh, yeah, call with all the you people. It's really like, oh, yeah, do these two here. Funny how we, um... Oh, hi, Def Jam, by the way. I'm sorry, I didn't saw you. Ay, 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 how's it going? Funny how V is saying these things consider her own situation. <laughs> yeah, hope it will be. Thanks See? again, V. Hello? See, hello. I don't even know to whom I'm supposed to talk. They're just, like, doing their meditation stuff. No, no. C major, then G. How are things, Jake? All good? Great, I'd say. The kidneys Great. take him just like a new oil filter. Aww. You have my thanks, V. Hey, you know any samurai songs? On a night like this, I'm not thinking about anarchy. It's all about unity, brother. Fairborn. Know this number? What you do, you guys? No time for songs. I'm honestly, I am ready. Where, where the fuck is Panem? There. Oh, even like the sound is still like as if I was in the bed. That's interesting. Hello. So this is where you escape to when you need to think. I never escape. Any for your thoughts? I have none. I mean, I don't even know. I'm so tense I barely caught a wink last night. It's likely to be the same tonight. What's eating you? Well, let's see. Tomorrow, I'll lead my whole clan to near certain death. As if that's not enough, Saul is suddenly concurring with everything I say. And I don't even know if that's good or bad. Fuck. Baby, thank you so much for 20 months. People thank are so doubting us. Support. This is so much appreciated. How are you but they going? still believe it. It all goes to shit. Pan Am will be there for them. Because who else? Right? Exactly. Who if not you? That's what I mean. It shouldn't be me. It should be... Saul? If only he hadn't gone and made all the wrong decisions to be a little more like me. I'm scared to the bone something will go wrong. That everyone will... Nobody's dying tomorrow, Pan Am. You don't know that. The fam. They're tougher than you think. Bullets don't distinguish between tough and weak. Well, you took a bullet through your entire body, Penham, and you still survived it. V? Yes. Yeah? Are you not afraid to die? Oops. I am. All the fucking time. You're great at hiding it. Time to head back, maybe? No. Let's sit here a while longer. This is doing me good. More than I thought. All right, let's go before our asses freeze over. Saul's back. Let's go. Maybe he turned up something new. That back I have is very annoying, but it should go away once we are in battle. Can we please get over with this? I hate those preparation missions. Just like, yeah. Hey, Pan Am, I followed you. Just run Looks a little like bit faster. Ready.
just got back from doing some reconnaissance. You'll want to see this. Get any sleep at all? The older you get, the less you need. Actually, true. <laughs> wouldn't have slept a wink for Can't a wait for like this, this time, at least. And good intel is just better than a good night's sleep. Take a gander. Thanks. <laughs> 